Here are the four greatest threats facing families today. Number one is social media. There's a ton of great things on social media, but I think we can all agree that the vast majority of it is garbage, or at least not adding real value to our lives. I think we can also all agree that social media affects the way we think, the way we see the world, the way we see ourselves, the way we feel, and the way we act. And if we're not using it well, it can be a wrecking ball in our families, especially for our kids. So we and our family really limit consumption of social media and encourage creation. So we're always watching our consumption versus creation ratio. Number two, busyness. Families are crazy busy today. Now, a good life is a busy life, but it doesn't have to be too busy. If you're running around all the time, feel like a taxi driver, going, going, going all the time, and you don't have enough time to just be, you're gonna miss out on so much of the goodness of just being present and being together and enjoying life. Number three is fighting. There's way too much fighting going on, way too much contention. And in spite of the fact that some people say that fighting is normal and fighting is healthy, I totally disagree. We have seven children and we don't fight. My wife and I don't fight, our kids don't fight, we just don't fight. We disagree, we debate, we talk about all the kinds of things and, and we have little scuffles, but we don't fight because fighting doesn't feel good and it doesn't help and it's not necessary. Now there are some times where very hard conversations have to happen and that may lead to some fights, but for the most part, we don't have to fight and we can eliminate the, the fighting and the, the horrible feeling and results that it brings in families. And then number four is living separate lives. So many good families look more like a bunch of roommates doing life separately but sharing the same residence. I want my family to do life together. The years that we have all of us under the same roof are so short, so fleeting, and I wanna use those precious years doing things together. So Rachel and I decided many years ago, we're gonna chase big dreams and big goals, but never at the expense of our family. We do things together. Yes, that's more work and it's more expensive, but oh man, it is so worth it. So those are four greatest threats facing families today. Which one's threatening your family the most? Or what would you add to this list? For more strategies and tools to create an extraordinary family life, follow me.